Welcome to the video and in this one we're going to take an updated look at how you can download your photos from iCloud to your Windows PC. Now I did a video on this back in 2015 which is now outdated so we're going to cover how we do it now in 2017. So basically what you want to do is get yourself across to support.apple.com and once you're on support.apple.com you want to do a search for iCloud for Windows and once you do that you'll be brought to a screen like this with a download link. I've put the link in the description but it could change so once you get onto this page download and install the software from Apple. So once you've got it installed the computer will reboot itself and once it's rebooted you'll be offered the option to log into iCloud. So I've already logged in here and once you've logged in you'll see that we've got the photos option here. Within the options for it you can change where you're going to download your photos to. I think by default it goes into iCloud. Uh, photos iCloud. If you're not bothered where they're going just leave that as it is. If you've got a specific area on your computer that you want to save these to go ahead and change it. So once you've got that set up and you're all logged in you can close that down and then we want to go down to File Explorer. So if we left click on File Explorer you'll see here now that we've got iCloud Photos. So if we left click on iCloud Photos you'll see that we've got two or three options here and you'll also see here that we've got Download Photos and Videos. Now if you left click on that you'll be offered a dialog box to select which photos you want to download. So for our purpose we're going to download them all. If you don't get this option straight away it could be that your library has been prepared. Just give it a little bit of time and then eventually you will get this. So once you've selected everything you go ahead and hit download and your downloads will begin. Now depending on how many photos you got and how fast your internet connection is it could take a while but if you double click on downloads you'll see that you've got your folders here from your years and they will slowly populate with your photos. So that's a quick look, an updated look at how you can download all your photos in one go and I'd like to thank you for watching.